hi welcome to my youtube channel today i'm going to show you how to add custom uh, account tab with custom fields in ultimate member so first you have to install the code snippet plugin so you can manage the custom codes that you put on your site so let's go to plugins add new wait for the site to load and then search for code snippets and then activate and uh, install the plugin once you install the plugin it should show in the left sidebar all snippets and you'll see some examples for customizing your, your WordPress site. So let's add a custom tab and along with the custom cost with the custom profile fields in the account form. So first go to www.champ.ninja.com. It's my personal site. And then go to tutorials and look for add a custom account tab with profile form fields here so you have to copy the code the class from my tutorial here on my website just copy it and then create a new snippet using the code snippet plugin Add your title here, UM custom account tab and fields, paste the code here, activate it or save changes. If you click on the activate, it will automatically save the code and, and then activate it. So once you added the class, you have to declare the account tab and the fields. Let's copy the code from my website. Here, you can uh, they, uh, declare the account tab and then they you can add the form that you can uh, use from the UM forms. Copy this and paste. You can paste it along with the class code or you can create a new snippet. But uh, in my example, you can uh, append it be just below the class. So here in the function, you can uh, add the parameters so for the tab id this is the account slug that sh uh, will show in the account for for example uh, uh, password privacy these are the slug so you you, you have to do deter determine or declare what slug that you want to display uh, let's try this is my tab and then you want to name it profile this is uh, the profile tab title just like account or change password or privacy and then the button title I'll leave it as save the tab icon I'll leave it as user and then leave it as 100 by default the position for the 100 is the general tab uh, i'll explain it to you later if you want to make the this custom tab as the primary or the default tab that you want to show once you visit the account page so let's save this page uh, this snippet save it let's wait for the page to load and then 
let's wait for this to load here you'll see that uh, I created the tab but there's no form here so you can uh, create the tab and the ultimate member forms page so if you want to add custom fields just create a custom uh, just create a profile form uh, for example this is uh, um custom or um fields and then choose profile form or you can use registration form either it yeah uh, it doesn't matter it will uh, show us a account form so let's add a field let's add the first name and then the last name and lastly let's add a gender yeah and then create the form once the form is saved just copy the form ID in the code just add the form ID in this function parameters here paste it here once uh, you paste it here don't forget to save the snippet okay once the snippet is saved it should show the form fields in the custom account tab now see I'll try uh, te to test it let's see if it changed the data here it changes the data so in this uh, example it removes the primary or the default account tab which is the general tab if you want to enable that just comment this line and these lines it's under the account tabs function if you still need the default general tab here and that's all I hope you enjoyed this tutorial if you want to learn more about ultimate member customization let me know in the comment section and see you in the next video thank you